Militants attack Mali's main military base. Heavy gunfire was heard early on Friday at the main military base outside Mali's capital Bamako before easing after about an hour. After the gunfire subsided at around 600 DMT, helicopters circled above the Kati base, which is about 15 kilometers from Bamako. A convoy carrying the leader of Mali's ruling junta, Colonel Asimigata, sped away from his house in Kati in the direction of Bamako. Islamist militants linked to Anqada and Islamic State have repeatedly attacked army bases across the country during a decade-long insurgency, but never so close to the capital. The army said late on Thursday that Anqada linked militants had staged coordinated attacks against several military camps earlier in the day, several hundred kilometers north of Bamako, killing one soldier and wounding 15. Mali's junta came to power in an August 2020 coup that began as a mutiny at the Kati base. It staged a second coup in 2021 to force out a civilian interim president who was at odds with Gaita. Gaita then became interim president. He plans to continue to lead a transitional government until elections are held in 2024. His government has sport repeatedly with neighboring countries and international powers over election delays, alleged army abuses and cooperation with Russian mercenaries in their fight against the Islamist insurgency. Despite coming to power pledging to stamp out the insurrection, the junta has been unable to prevent the insurgents from extending their operations further south from their havens in the north and center. This is BBS News. Thank you and see you in the next videos.